Hello everybody, so this video I'm gonna be talking about why bad things happen to good people or maybe I can title this why light workers go through rough patches in life and I'm not only gonna be talking about people who are medium psychics or any other kind of uh, people who work for spirit, you know, to communicate messages, but anybody else that, that creates a difference in other people, nurses, doctors, um, you name it. There's a lot of people that work in this in service, in light work, basically. And what light work means, uh, mostly, usually little people think that that only applies to people that work with spirit, but light worker to me is anybody that brings light to other humans through service. So we fall under that, you know, people that do do this kind of work, but so do nurses. Nurses bring light and service to other people um, that need their help, you know, so stuff like that. But I'm going to talk about it from my perspective and try my best to share that with you guys, I guess. But so why do we go through bad stuff? You know. I always had a rough time understanding why because you know I always I have always or I've always tried to do everything from a good heart ever since I was a young kid I mean everything that I did was with the correct intention not always you know not always I have done stuff that I, I am not proud of but major stuff I can honestly tell you that everything that I, I did or I do I do it with good intention. And that's something that I'm very proud of because you don't come across that a lot. But at the same time, I feel like that's why I'm here. I feel like I didn't come to do things for me or to be selfish. I'm, I came, I'm here to be of service uh, to God and, and to help others. So I've always been like that since I was a little kid. However, I've been through a lot of situations and I'm still struggling with a lot of things uh, that maybe led me to do wrong things or do things that I shouldn't have done or feel a certain way or, you know, hate stuff, just stuff like that. For example, I'm going to start with something that has, that is still a problem to me and it still bothers me. And I'm sharing these stories with you guys as personal stuff, but I feel like a lot of people that work, you know, with medium psychics, all of that. Um, they portray a perfect life and that's not true. Nobody has a perfect life. So I wanna show that part of me where I'm open and I'm saying, hey, I'm not perfect either. Um, but what I wanted to talk about was, for example, the relationship that I have with my parents. Ever since I was young, it hasn't been the best. It's not that they're bad parents, but we are not as close as you see their parents being to me. I don't know, it's weird. Like, I see parents and they're like super close to their kids and stuff like that. And my parents are, I know they love me, but they love me in their own way. But it still hurts me because it's not as how I wanted it, how I wish it was. It's weird. But, and that's something I've always been feeling since I was a little kid. Um, we're not very close. That's just how it's always been. I mean, my mom right now lives in a whole different state in a different city state my dad lives in a whole different country right now and then i'm here alone um it hurts it sucks but because of that bad situation i'm able to help other people that are in my situation so that's really the point that i want to bring up people that are of service to help others always go through bad stuff or through rough patches because how am I going to help others if I don't know how it feels? Do you understand? Um, another thing that was a big deal in my life was my last relationship that I had um, was very painful to me because I absolutely loved this guy, you know? Um, and, and we broke up and it was very rough for me. I mean, it was extremely, extremely rough. We were dating for a long time, and I I knew the per you know I knew this guy for a long time for a long time, 
So to me, even though I com I made some mistakes um, in that relationship, I tried my best to fix it, and it hurt whenever there was no apology. And that's that's and that's okay. It happens. But at the moment, it was just very, very heartbreaking. It was a lot. Uh, I just felt like I was the end of the world. So it sucks. And now I'm in a whole different part of my life, and I'm so happy that I'm out of that hole because it was bad. But because of that hurt. And because of that pain, I'm able to help people with, you know, spiritual messages or any advice because I know how it feels. I've had clients that do readings with me and it's about love. It's about relationships. And yes, messages come through spirit. You know, it comes and it, as I, 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 it comes through me. But I also am able to put in a little bit of, I guess, advice and a little bit of, um, what's that word that I'm looking for? Like perspective, because I understand you. I know what you've been through. I know how it feels. So I'm able to put that into the messages as well, you know? Um, so that's that. That's something that I wanted to share. We cannot as light workers, as people that are here to help others, we cannot have a perfect life because we wouldn't be able to understand what others are going through. We just wouldn't. I mean, there's, there's that's weird. <laughs> it's no way. So that's why a lot of people that are that are here in this planet to help others and to bring light to others usually have a really rough rough time um it might seem like they don't but we do <laughs> um i don't really share my personal stuff it's just something i don't know it's just i never do that i don't like to show that part of me but i've been starting to be more open because i'm understanding now the process and why things happen and stuff like that. Um, it's been a very changing experience this last year and this past month even more. But um, yeah, that's that. Just wanted to go ahead and, and share that because a lot of people that, that do good, they're always like, oh, why I do all the good things? Why do I go through bad things? But again, think about that. Think about the experiences that you're gaining. Like, yes, it hurts, but you're building a, a sense of um, understanding for others. Now, whenever you see people in the situation that you went through, you're able to be like, you're able to understand and be able to be of service to them, okay? So I hope you guys have a good week. Bye-bye.